Hey guys, it's Yavar, your hub for tech and electrified vibes. Smash that like button if you're pumped and new here. Hit subscribe and ring the bell. Let's roll. Today we're diving into something super personal for me. For months, I've been itching to swap out my ride. I've been a Lexus guy forever. Smooth, reliable, that buttery luxury feel. Chef's kiss. But lately I've been craving something fresh, maybe a bit bolder. First, I eyed the Genesis GV70. Looked stunning, right? But then I heard the service horror stories. Long waits, pricey parts, pass. Next up, Range Rover Sport. Oh man, that British swagger. But Reddit and forums, flooded with complaints, electronics glitches, breakdowns on mountain roads. No thanks, especially here in Switzerland, where the Alps don't forgive. So I fired up ChatGPT and asked it to pit the Range Rover Sport against my trusty Lexus NX across every category. Design, performance, costs, you name it. Spoiler, Lexus crushed it. Bulletproof reliability won the day, so I stuck with what I knew. But then, whispers started. This Chinese powerhouse called BYD. At first, I shrugged it off. Chinese cars? In Switzerland? Nah. But curiosity hit, so I binged 100-plus videos, scoured forums, and dug into specs. Mind blown. These aren't budget beaters anymore. They're tech-loaded beasts. I hit up ChatGPT again. Compare Lexus NX 2025 versus BYD SEAL UDMI. Boom. BYD edged out in efficiency, price, and wow factor. Suddenly, my loyalty was tested. Today, it's a head-to-head. -head. Lexus NX 450H plus 2025 versus BYD SEAL UDM I designed AWD 2025 built for Swiss Alps prices in USD. I've got slick comparison tables for you visual folks. Let's dive in. Let's start with style. The Lexus NX is pure elegance. Sharp spindle grill, LED razors, 4.66 meters of compact luxury. BYD Seal U, a bold beast, 4.77 meters, massive LED light bar, aggressive AWD stance, perfect for snowy Swiss roads. Check the table. This table shows Lexus's compact sleek design versus BYD's bigger, bolder look. Lexus's 20-inch wheels scream luxury, while BYD's torque vectoring AWD is built for Swiss winters. Winner, BYD Seal U. Its bold, modern vibe and alpine-ready stance steal the show. Lexus is sleek, but BYD screams, look at me. Team bold or team elegant? Inside its vibe city, Lexus NX, a luxury haven. Real leather, wood trim, 14-inch touchscreen, heated vented seats, 520 liters cargo for ski trips. BYD Seal U, family-ready, synthetic leather, panoramic roof, heads-up display, V2L outlet for camping, 425 liters boot, 1,440 folded. Here's the table. Lexus's bigger screen and real leather feel premium, while BYD's rotating screen and V2L outlet add family-friendly flair. Cargo? Lexus edges out slightly, but BYD's close when folded. Winner, Lexus NX. That plush leather and premium feel are unmatched. BYD's practical, but Lexus is a five-star hotel. Who's team luxury? Thumbs up. Time for power. Lexus NX 450H plus brings 304 horsepower, 0 to 100 in 6.3 seconds, E4 AWD for grip. BYD SEAL UDMI, 319 horsepower, 5.9 second sprint, torque vectoring AWD for Swiss hairpins. Here's the table. BYD's extra 15 horsepower and quicker sprint make it a beast, while Lexus's higher top speed is capped for efficiency. Both AWD systems tackle Alps, but BYD's torque vectoring shines. Winner, BYD SEAL U. That 5.9-second sprint edges out Lexus's smooth ride. Speed freaks, who's with me? Switzerland loves efficiency. 
Lexus, 76 kilometers electric, 700 kilometers total, 1.3 liters per 100 kilometers hybrid. BYD, 70 kilometers electric, a massive 1,080 kilometers combined, 1.1 liters per 100 kilometers. Here's the table. BYD's 1,080 kilometers total range crushes it for long Swiss trips, and its 1.1 liters per 100 kilometers sips fuel. Lexus's 76-kilometer electric range is great for short commutes. Winner, BYD Seal U. That 1,080-kilometer range is a game-changer for Alpine treks. Lexus is efficient, but BYD goes the distance. Team Eco, sound off. Both are Euro NCAP five-star champs. Lexus, safety system plus 3.0, predictive cruise, 10 airbags. BYD, die pilot assist, 360 cams, seven airbags, heads up display. Here's the table. Lexus packs 10 airbags for max protection, while BYD's 360 cams and heads up display add tech flare. Both are five star safe for Swiss roads, Winner, Lexus NX. 10 airbags and polished tech make it a fortress. BYD's solid, but Lexus nails safety. Time for the wallet test. Lexus NX 450H Plus starts at $70,682, premium with killer resale. BYD seal UDMIAWD, $60,286 with 0% leasing. Here's the table. BYD's lower $60,286 price and 0% leasing beat Lexus's $70,682 price. Both get up to $5,900 in Swiss PHEV incentives, but Lexus holds stronger resale value. Winner, BYD Seal U. That's $60,286 price and 0% leasing scream value. Lexus is a long term gem but BYD's budget-friendly. Ownership costs matter. Lexus, $1,180 to $1,416 per year service, in $6,490 over five years, eight-year battery warranty. BYD, $472 to $708 per year, approximately $3,540 over five years, eight-year, 200,000-kilometer warranty. Here's the table. BYD's low $472 to $708 yearly service and $3,545 year total save big. Lexus's higher costs come with premium support, but BYD's warranty is longer. Winner, BYD Seal U, low $472 to $708 per year service and approximately $3,540 over five years save big. Lexus is premium but BYD's a wallet win. Who's the champ? Lexus NX 450H Plus took two categories, interior and safety, with plush luxury and fortress-like vibes for Alpine cruises. BYD Seal U DMI AWD crushed five categories, design, performance, efficiency, price, and ownership costs, with a bold look, 1,080-kilometer range, and $60,286 price tag. The winner, BYD Seal UDMIAWD. It's got value, range, and Alpine ready power that flipped my Lexus loyalty. Lexus is a luxury dream, but BYD dominates for 2025. What's your pick? Team BYD or Lexus loyalist? Want me to compare other cars with cutting edge tech? Drop it in the comments. If I see tons of love for a specific car, I'll make the video. Like, share, subscribe, and let's keep the buzz going. Next week, hybrids under $50,000. Drive smart, stay charged. Want more awesome tech and home tips? Check out our other videos right now. Drop a comment below. What's your favorite thing we covered today? Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one.